With me in studio, I have three guests. One, a DJ, and two of them are artists, and the other one is an MC. Start off. Anyway, so Karibu ni sana to the interview section. Uh, mm -hmm. Go ahead and introduce yourself. I can see you guys dressed up, yeah. looking mellows and everything. What's good? What's popping? Karibu ni Hip Hop Thursday. Okay. Yeah. First yeah. of all, uh, my names are Floki Jones. Floki Jones. Jones yeah. Like Floki. Yeah, Floki. You know, the what? flowing key. <laughs> I see you, yeah. I see you. <laughs> I'm a rapper. You're a rapper? A hip hop rapper, yeah. Mm -hmm. And your fellow brother over there, what's good? What's oh, popping? I'm flimsy. Mm -hmm. I'm the hype man. I'm also a photographer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ah, nice stuff, nice stuff. How make? Yeah. What's good, DJ? I'm good. What's up? What's popping? Good. Fresh kabisa. Turntables, ni nini? We appreciate. Kindly to me as paza sauti, ki paza sauti. Check, check. Hey, Sawa, I've seen you bling, bro. I've seen you bling. Asante. <laughs> Easy. So, guys, this is how we do it here on Hip Hop Thursday. We want to get to know you better, yeah? So, Floki, maybe Tweleze Muziki Lianza VP. When did you fall in love with this, you know, industry? And how did you get in? Okay. I started rapping since 2013. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. McMill and Calligraph, they're the ones who inspired me no back way. then. Yeah. McMill? Yeah. Shout out to you, bro. <laughs> and Calligraph. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Cali. Yeah. I am uh, representing Kenya as, as usual. MC. Yeah. MC Flimsy. Yeah. What's good? So why why decide to, you know, become MC on, uh, especially hip, the hip-hop industry? You know, see what way you believe in MCs. Who call you as Nyambie, you know? Uh, <laughs> and it's Angwaje, Frank, Master Flex, you know, they've been the biggest MCs of all time. So why did you decide to be an MC there in the Kenyan hip hop industry? Yeah, the reason why I decided was because if you love something, you just have to do it with passion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's something which came to me mm -hmm. and I decided to take it. Yeah. Okay, all right. Anyway, back to you, Floki. Nimejwa Leo ati ukonango to premi. Pray, pray, for for, pray for me. Pray for me. So pray for me. Me gospel, ama it's just you know a few words you wanna chant to God. Let us uh, know about okay. you. Okay. Pray for pray, me song. Pray for me. Mm -hmm. It's a hip hop song. It's a hip hop but, song. But a clean hip hop. Clean hip hop. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yeah. Dirty hip hop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Obvious. <laughs> Obvious. Yeah. All right. Cool. So a uh, clean, clean hip hop. What yeah. about it? Okay. Pray for me. Mm -hmm. I came up with I came up with the title. Long time ago, like three years ago, mm -hmm. so I wrote the hook, and after some some years, mm -hmm. I decided I'm gonna use this song as my first song in my album. Mm -hmm. They are my album. Mm -hmm. the, the the one that I'm dropping this year, it's pray for me. Mm -hmm. So I decided to call the the title. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you guys work as a collective or what? Like, how does uh, Flimsy influence your life of creativity? Okay, first of all, yeah, my brother Flimsy over here is my best friend. Oh. He's my motivator sometimes. Uh -huh. Yeah. How, how did you guys meet? <laughs> <laughs> besties, how did you besties meet? <laughs> okay, we met back then in 2013. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 2013 until 2020. Yeah. Seven years, almost seven years down the line. Yeah. Okay, so back to, you know, Pray For Me. You featured another artist called yeah. Osa. Uh, Osa Ndionani Tena? Okay, Osa mm -hmm. is a hip hop artist from Texas. Mm -hmm. Okay, he wow. lives in Texas. Eish, going international, bro. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so he lives in Texas. What does he do there in Texas? Okay, he's a hip hop artist just like me, mm -hmm. but he's more advanced than me. Ah, yeah. and he agreed to be part of your jam. Yeah. Like, bro, you got lines. <laughs> Can I say randomly to an Akubalama Jihome? You say to Akubali out of nowhere, mm -hmm. keep us a salty, bro. Yeah. <laughs> out of nowhere, I'm saying Akubali Kuchapa Nini, Goma Nawewe. Yeah, Obviously, that's a very big you either move. have a bright future ahead or you're good at what you do. You're yeah. freaking good at what you do. So, how did it feel, you know, him accepting that to work with you actually? Okay, Osa, at first, I was, I remember I was back, back in high school. Mm -hmm. Now, when you turn up to the VIG, I saw this, this guy called me Osa, yeah. mm -hmm. that is IG handle. Mm -hmm. So I decided to text him. He didn't reply. Yeah. Broke a cool blue text just yeah. like that. Yeah, but at a signature. He was so awkward, I replied. So I was him text two day in day out. No way, you kept on persisting. Yeah, persisting. And it finally paid off. Yeah. So I can hear 
send me some of your work. Uh -huh. So I just, he, he gave me his number. Mm -hmm. I sent it to his Texas number. Yeah. No, 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 so I'm impressed with your work. So mm -hmm. I can realize which which song did you want me to verse in? Uh -huh. So he gave me a condition, a condition. Which so he, he told me his featuring charges is 400k. So I was like God, he is not to happy with life. So I can show ni mlipe 400k mm -hmm. or the song yenye nataka jazz verse mm -hmm. iki mbamba so ndo ata nifanye for free so i decided to go to the studio and i nikachapa hiyo kitu mbaya sana mm -hmm. so nika mtumia and Wee. the favor god's favor akaitikia tu verse yani uka ukamwambia pray for me ukamwambia god maze hapa lazima ka, ka wa, ka lazima, lazima lazima so you didn't get to pay the 400k yeah, eventually yeah. Wow, and where is he originally from? Yeah, originally he's from Nigeria, oh, but he wow. lives in Texas. Wow, yeah. so that means you've, you know, broken boundaries. Yeah. Texas to Nigeria and then Kenya. Yeah. Awesome. Uh, do you think there's a challenge, Apo Penyomesema, when these guys charge very expensive, yet you're just an upcoming artist? Is that a challenge? Yeah, it's a challenge. Mm -hmm. Like, you find, like, I as an artist, you, when you text these big artists, Sometimes and as a reply can be a such an amount of money. Na kose kupe conditions no no. So uko like yes, I have the talent in me. Na taka to feature in a collab one. Mm -hmm. So I can pay some such amount of money. So I need to make sure. True. Yeah. Hey, MC. Kuna msa si kuambi amajendo MC kwa event yangu bro. <laughs> it's a bit of me to a kakiru. Eh, so you know, I've got a challenge. Uh huh. You, but I love that I talk on my connection. Mm hmm. Can be myself and MC. I've got a kinetic time. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay. Now, uh, sorry. Look, uh, Floki. Hey, flimsy Floki. Mazen ye de moge koyo unadua. Anyway, so Floki, you met wango mazingi ne. You know. Now, actually, pray for me. Look, four months ago, na iko na views, bro. <laughs> Icon of views, but we to other audio tracks. Badoja to Abida, Bona, not some Bona. Actually, mm -hmm. when you dropped my first album, mm -hmm. I didn't have that capital to, shoot, to get shoot a video. Okay, so when you, this is my second album that I'm working with, ah, easier, uh -huh. that featuring a lot of artists. Mm -hmm. So, so we got more artists coming up, yeah, like okay. Chain Bees. Mm -hmm. Cassie Bages, uh -huh. Gaming Veja, actually, and Ben Calligraph Jones. I'm trying to reach him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. For sure. Calligraph, if you're watching Hip Hop Thursday, the only hip hop show in the two for four, you've got an artist over here looking for you, bro. Tafadhali, yeah. reach out. Najwa Juzi alikuwa ameya niko na King Kaka Kambi wa, you know. <laughs> Take up these people, like yeah, I said, it's not my responsibility. It's not my job. So what do you think about that when Kali said that? I mean, kidogo na skill ma uchungu, but in our uma lakini 2020 si mwaka wa makasiriko. 2020 ni mwaka wa komoka. Komoka, that's a new one. <laughs> that's a new one, I didn't know. 2020 yeah. ni mwaka wa komoka. Yeah. But how did you feel when Kali said, you know, as an artist, it's not my responsibility to be training other or trying to bring upcoming artists to my level? What do you think about that? For me, what I can say is, yeah, Kale, when you two, when you actually me, my role model. Mm -hmm. So when you meet Mwangalianga, he the eyes if any of any kinka kali sema. So eyes if any of any kinka kali sema. So mm -hmm. the only anangalianga um say, does he has a, does he have a talent? No, no. I can a passion here, kid. No, no. Kamu kona ukona ile capability ako. So one is a fanya kolabona. No, no. So. Si si ezim judge when you actually reply actually you know opinion ya kiko wake mm -hmm. yeah. so you're good with that yeah i'm good with that <laughs> well i talk to us safe up kama mekumbiza roho sema you know <laughs> express yourself tumesema 2020 ni mwaka wako mwaka anyway so how many tracks do you have for the fans who are watching you for the first i mean for your new fans watching you for the first time and they're wondering um si ako na ngoma ngapi so fan do ni kama you know i want to be part of this gang or how many tracks do you have so far 
a 15 15 audios uh -huh. zingine ziko na, produ uh, na producers je ya chini mm -hmm. still i'm working for visa mm -hmm. yeah and so have, more songs to come and you have a new project coming up that's yeah. what you haven't told us yeah. uh, yet so your project mpia what is it about what's the name of the track when should we expect it you know briefly uh e project the my next my next song and you come it's featuring Chinbiz from Tanzania. Nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So only on a Najua Kenya, Marapo Kenya to Msiaki Boka, Azir play DM. So Killer Day may look to the same way I was Kwa Osa DM. Mm -hmm. So only got to coaching this. Ah. So I can reply. So Ka Fanya to hook up. Hey. I think Kenyan artists want a choma, Joe. Honestly, Kenyan artists want a choma at some point. Yeah. Why would you not reply to somebody's DM? Okay, I know I'll be attacked, but it has to be, it has to be something that is bringing value to the other person. I think I believe. So if that is, if whatever you're giving me is not bringing value, I don't see how I should work with you. But can we be a bit lenient? Because that's what I see these artists that you're working with right now are trying to do. Yeah. They're trying to be lenient with you because they see a brighter future for you. Yeah. So what's the future like for you? See, what you want on a future, yako, but wait, 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 in your own words, what's your future like? Yeah, to me, my future, actually I would say that 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 I would say yeah. So I'm working with one of my lazima ni fanye collabo na Kali. Ni fanye yani hii album ina consist of big artists, you know. Ma moja ndio itakuwa tu single. So this song yenye niko na Chingbiz in a drop this month or next month. Yeah. Okay. All so right. So in like in 2 years time I believe I'll be a big artist. Okay. You'll be a bigger artist yeah. in Kenya. Yeah. My blessings, my blessings, my blessings, my Welcome. blessings. So make them party blessings, Pia. Alafu, let me ask you a quick one. DJs, have DJs tiled up in 2020? Because last 2018, DJs were to blame for playing Kenyan music. They were playing Niger music. So according to you, so far so good. Have DJs tiled up since the play Kenyan music hashtag? A little bit. A little bit. Yeah. They're doing their job. Yeah. Home make, home make. Yeah. I think like DJs are putting a lot of jokes. Mike, keep us a salty. Okay, like what I can say about that is my DJ say I'm a chunk of muka. We like normally play Kenyan music. Actually, we're talking about the underground. Kuna aga clubs kada zenye suche za koma zama artists zenye underground like the Sons in Kilimani. Like they normally have a hip hop night for upcoming artists. Oh, nice. Yeah, so I think those are great platforms. That's a great platform. And also. Event organizers, club hosts, who may take an initiative to actually, you know, organize this. Yeah. Let's call them tiny for now, but mm. they are big to artists. As much as you know, they're situated in random days like Tuesday. Yeah. You know, when the club is not banging, may I'd want us to have Friday nights. You know, upcoming artists coming in on a Friday night, at least two hours, four hours maybe, just to bring in the crowd and have something going on. Anyway, I wanted to ask you a question, Homik. <clears throat> so there's that ka nini, how am I gonna put it? When you want to play a song, eh? The other day we saw a DJ got shot because Yeah, he's my friend. Actually. What on the street? Yeah, him. sorry well, about that man. What on the street? I don't know if it's rumors or whatever, but he either it's because of a girl or maybe he didn't play the song he was supposed to play. You know, so bone of contention here, Sazingine, was when you're club, how attack you could Kenyan music. Yeah, sure. Sure. So she de you kwa mm -hmm. majorly sisi wa Kenya si wenyewe. Not you like normally Kenyans come in and say like we play Kenyan music but themselves oh, they don't appreciate Kenyan mm -hmm. music. No. Mm -hmm. no. Tukiangalia simu yako tuangalie ni ngoma ngapi za Kenya ziko hapo. Eh? You'll be shocked by the you get. You'll be shocked. So it's so hard for us <laughs> man say but mm -hmm. blame you to kwetu my DJ. True. But we are really trying to make the industry level as, mm -hmm. as we play both Kenyan and international music, mm -hmm, you see? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. MC Flimsy, yeah. what's your plan this 2020? My plan first, at a sequence, mm -hmm. plan yangu ni kumeki brand ya Melo. Melo, I'm getting to that, I'm getting yeah. to that. Uh -huh. so, so you're the you're brand ambassador or you're the creator of the clothing, cloth line? No, I'm not the brand ambassador, mm -hmm. but we are together. Okay. We are like, like a crew. Cool but it's, it's our brand, yeah. Like Kappa, like Gucci, mm -hmm. yeah. 
So that's my plan. That's okay. your plan. Kidogo mtoleze kusu melos, because I've also seen a YouTube video of you guys trying to promote your clothing. I can only see sweatshirts, t-shirts, but in the video I saw different things. I even saw pants. Where can we get this clothing, bro? Okay. Uh, <laughs> we, need, we need some sweatshirts and hoodies going on around here. I mean, you know, for the producer and... So no, yeah. even for guys to win next time. Yeah, yeah merchandise. Okay, Melos, uh, we started it back in 2016. Mm -hmm. So, atukwa na zile moves at tunye za tingine za hoods, we can make yani different clothes. Mm -hmm. So, tunye kwa printing two t-shirts. Okay. Then we sell. Mm -hmm. Then, nikaka with my guy here, nikam show, actually, iji na tunye za ifanyi kwe brand. Like, Kappa, Gucci, and such. No, no. So, aka pendeo idea yangu. So, we try to work towards it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Na melo zina manisha, because I know melo means, you know, melo, slow, mellow, chill. Mm, no. what, what does mellows mean according to you guys? Mellows, it's a brand, and mellows ah, means. Like Gucci, yeah. Prada. Mellows okay. means someone okay. who is peaceful mm -hmm. and calm in mind. Uh -huh. Aha. Yeah. Someone okay. who loves people. Uh -huh. yeah. So where can we get this clothing? You can find us on Instagram, mm -hmm. Melos Nation, mm -hmm. Facebook, Twitter. Yeah. You can own as a mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Guys, that's it for today. Lakini kidogo flimsy na floki watakujana ngomayao pre for me. Of course, uh, Osa. Osa is not here with us. He's all the way in Texas. But guys, upcoming artist over there, you've seen, you've heard what can be done for you to get collabs going on. Calligraph, amekuwa chilia hapo, amekuweka blue ticks, usijali. Don't worry. Keep persisting on these other guys. They got you. Wow, guys, thank you so much for tuning in. This has been Hip Hop Thursday. On behalf of the team that has made this possible, Michelle Ashira, the camera operators, Barry Umo, Eddie Ogoe, and of course, our amazing producers, Ukoju Kwa Gallery. You don't get to see them, but they do a lot of hard work. Homemake, thank you so much. DJ Rajes, I'm a potia kidogo, but yeah, for sure. So, where, any plans for this weekend? Any plans, maybe? Okay, this weekend, no plans yet, uh -huh. but you can find me on all social medias at homemake underscore DJ. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, all right. Last words to keep on social media platforms. Mazi Wambe was a talk patawapi, melo clothing, flimsy, floki, what talk patawapi, because my ends are to sumba up and kienda. Okay, my Instagram handle ni Floki Jones official, mm -hmm. Twitter Floki Jones, mm -hmm. and Facebook Floki Jones. Mm -hmm. When it comes to Melos, you can find us still on Instagram, Melos Nation, mm -hmm. uh, Twitter, Melos Nation One, mm -hmm. Facebook, Melos Nation Clothing. All right. Yeah. How much is a hoodie? A hoodie, they are, there's the 2K one and 1750. 1750. T-shirts? T-shirts, 500, and there's the one for mm -hmm. uh, the glow, glow in the dark, oh, 700. Glow in the dark products, yeah. all right. Flimsy, maybe last words, where can we find you on social media platforms? My uh, IG handle is Flimsy Arts, mm -hmm. where you can check my work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the handle for now I'm using. Okay. All right, cool. And you can find me as Karen Kankang on all social media platforms.